Hi, the purpose of this presentation is to discuss the Chevrolet Malibu Hybrid. I did a presentation on the Malibu Hybrid earlier, and after reviewing my own presentation, I decided that I was too harsh on the Malibu. Uh, I'll start off by, first of all, saying I like the body style of the Malibu. I've always said to myself, if Chevrolet would take the technology that they have in the Volt and incorporate it into a car such as the Malibu or the Impala, they would have a big winner on their hands. Now, Chevrolet has done that to some extent with the Malibu Hybrid. And the fuel economy ratings for the Malibu Hybrid are excellent for someone who's coming from a gasoline-powered vehicle. If you're currently driving a vehicle that is powered only by gasoline, then you will be absolutely super pleased with the uh, your miles per gallon rating on the Malibu Hybrid. It's 49 in the city, 43 on the oops, 43 on the highway, and 46 miles per gallon combined. And that's that's close to 50 all the way around. That's you're gonna you're going to be pleasantly surprised with how much money you're gonna save. Now I would imagine I don't know this for a fact, but I would imagine that with the owner's manual there'll be something similar that with with the Malibu hybrid that comes with the uh, something similar to the Volt, in that the oil changes are not every so many thousands of miles or whatever. Like a regular car, a car that's powered only by gasoline. You have to change the oil on a very regular basis because as long as you're driving, the engine is always running. That is not true with the hybrid vehicles. Now, with the Chevrolet Volt, previous year Chevrolet Volt, and the Cadillac ELR, you're supposed to change the oil when the oil change indicator tells you to or every two years, whichever comes first. Now, I would imagine that the the Malibu Hybrid is going to have something close to that or something like that, where, you, where something's going to remind you to change the oil or you don't go over so many months or years without changing the engine oil because you, don't, you won't need to change the engine oil uh, on a regular basis because the engine will not be running all of the time while you're driving. And that, in addition to saving money on gasoline, is going to save you money and time as far as maintenance goes. So it's less less time on maintenance in that area. And the car also has regenerative regenerative braking. In my book, in my mind, all electric vehicles should have regenerative braking. If they do not, well I can't think of any car, any electric vehicle that does not have it. But all electric vehicles should have regenerative braking. A regenerative braking system. And what that does is allow, it allows the computer or the, 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 the electronics in the car to take the moving inertia of the vehicle and use that to provide electricity, feed the electricity back into the power supply or back into the battery. And gasoline vehicles just can't do that. Gasoline vehicles just suck gas, period. And the body style of the of the Malibu Hybrid is a good body style. I like the size of the car. I like the style of the car. It doesn't look like a used doesn't look like, it does not look like a huge overgrown sneaker on wheels, which is what a lot of electric cars look like. Like BMWs, in my mind, BMW is big on making ugly electric cars or ugly hybrid cars. But the Malibu has good styling, and I, I like the styling of the Malibu.